Hello, my name is Howen Lee, and this is my self-critique video for APS 1013, critical review paper one on the voice of customer and innovation. The paper contents will be scored in terms of six elements of objectives based on the given rubric. Note that I'll be using the abbreviation VOC a lot in this video, which refers to the voice of the customer. The first objective is the problem issue and a topic. In terms of problem identification, I did well introducing the concept of VOC and I constructed the first half of the paper as a case comparison to explain the importance of listening to VOC. Since this CR1 was mainly based on um, case studies and research outcomes, I did, didn't list out all the assumptions, but I did stand at two opposite positions to present the case comparison. Therefore, I will give myself a level four for identification and a level three for assumptions. The second objective is the analysis of the problem. In this paper, the main method I adopted to convey my ideas was through case studies. When discussing the importance of VOC, I used two opposite case studies. The ice cream allergic um, Pontiac case is a successful case of listening to the VOC, while the failure of Volkswagen Fantium shows that a company should never skip the second step of the 17-step innovation problem-solving process. This method was consistently used throughout the paper, and this method provides a profound analysis of the co complexities of an issue. Therefore, I would give myself a level 4 for both method and alternative points of view. The third objective is the uh, credibility of resources. Resources from various sources were provided to support all the ideas. The sources include uh, primers, books, and course materials. All these sources were interpreted and evaluated to construct a comprehensive analysis of the BOC. Thus, I would give myself a level 4 for this objective. The limitations were not mentioned in the paper. However, I successfully integrated my research outcomes from different resources to comprehensively discuss the importance of VOC and to introduce the scientific and log logical methodology for applying VOC innovation. I was a bit too ambitious to cover several aspects of VOC and I went over the word limit a lot at the end. Therefore, I kept uh, the conclusion brief, but it was still logically tied to the paper's contents. Therefore, I would give myself a level 1 for limitations, a level 4 for integration, a level 3 um, for the conclusion. The topic is not fresh, but I went over um, different sources to discover creative solutions, especially when discussing the collection of the VOC. I introduced the novel, novel data science approaches, uh, which are the merits of the big data era. What I didn't do well is that I didn't align my personal uh, experience of either providing or collecting VOC to the paper's contents. However, I did utilize my discussion posts and what I've learned in this course so far to synthesize, to synthesize my discussion in the paper. So it's a level three for creativity uh, finally, I consider this paper as a new approach to demonstrate my understanding of the course material. Uh, nevertheless, it was tailored to meet the CR1 requirements without taking too many risks. Thus, I would give myself a 3, three for communication and adaption. The final scores for each object are listed in this table. And in total, I got a 31 out of 40 or 82.5% for the CR1 paper. And thank you for watching.